Welcome to Webify demo video. In this video, I will give you a walkthrough of Webify app and its features. Let's start with integrating our Gmail or Outlook account, since it is mandatory to connect at least one account to start connecting with prospects and sending them emails. Navigate to Integrations menu to connect your account. You will see option to connect your Gmail or Outlook account. You will also have the option to connect your autoresponders account, so that you can directly add email lists to the autoresponder account from your Webify account. You can also integrate HubSpot and Pipedrive CRM accounts on this page. You will also have the option to connect Zapier account with Webify account by the API key available on this screen. Once you are done connecting your accounts, you can go back to the campaigns page and start finding prospects. You will see an option on the top right corner of the page to create a new campaign. A pop-up will appear where you have to enter the campaign name. The other details will be fetched automatically from the form that you have filled while creating your Webify account. These details will be used while sending emails to your prospects. You can also edit these details if needed. I will give the name, Photographers, to this campaign. When you scroll down we'll get two options. The first is to find leads, and the second option will be for uploading leads. If you already have a list of leads, you can directly upload it from here. Let's find new leads for now. We will have to choose a sector and location for finding prospects. Let's say we need to find photographers in New York City. Once you are done with selecting the sector and location, hit the Create Campaign button. And your campaign will be created successfully. It will take a couple of seconds to find high-quality new prospects for you. You will have the option to edit the campaign from here. If you want to update any details, you can click the Edit icon and update the details. You can also delete a campaign from here. The list of leads is ready now. Click on Access Leads icon to view the details of the leads. You can see there are thousands of leads that are fetched for you by Webify app. You can either send emails, view details, and access email address of these leads from here. On top of the page, you will see menus which are basically the stages of interactions with the lead. Once you connect with any lead from Find Leads menu, that particular lead will move onto the contacted menu. And once the prospect responds to you, it will further move onto the conversations menu. You can also add any lead to blacklist, which will be shown on the blacklist menu. All the scheduled emails will go under Scheduled menu. Once the scheduled emails are sent, those will also appear under Contacted menu. The most powerful feature of the Webify app is automation. You can create a new sequence where you can add multiple steps, by which a lead will go through, within defined time. You just have to add any lead to a sequence and Webify will automatically connect with that lead and perform the predefined actions. All the sequences will appear under Sequence menu, along with the option to create a new sequence. In case any email is not sent to the prospect due to any reason, it will appear under Bounced menu. Now, let's quickly send an email to a prospect. When you will click on the Send Email button, you will be redirected to the editor screen. You will have several options on this page to customize the email. First option is to choose any email template. If you have to send a same formatted email to multiple leads, you can create a new email template from the Email Template menu. After creating, you can choose that email template here. The email subject and body will be updated accordingly. Next option is to enter the recipient's email address, which will be pre-filled. You can also add or remove CC from here. Email subject field will also be pre-filled. You can edit it if required. The email body will be pre-written for you, but if you want to update it or if you don't find it satisfactory, you can remove the email content and click on Generate with AI button. It will take a couple of seconds, and Webify will write a new personalized email for you. The email is generated based on the details that you have provided while creating the campaign, and used your details like company name, services, and much more for personalization. You will have the option to add email signature, the signature will be fetched from your connected mail account and will be added at the end of the email body. Another powerful feature is the report generation. You can click on Attach Report button to attach an audit report of the current social presence of the prospect. Click on the Get Report button to fetch the report. You can also attach a custom file to the email from here. You can add dynamic variables to the email which helps in personalization. For example you can add company name variable in the email body and it will be replaced by the actual company name of the lead. You can also save this email as a new template for future use, and dynamic variables like lead's name, company name, address, etc. will be updated with respect to the lead every time. After customizing the email, you can send the email right now, or you can also schedule the email for a later date or time. Just hit the Schedule Email button and choose the time zone the date, and time at which the email needs to be sent. Webify will send the email for you at the exact time. You can check the scheduled emails under Scheduled menu. 
Here, you will have options to send the email now, edit the schedule time or date, or activate and deactivate the schedule. Let's send an email right now. Go back to the Find Leads menu and click the Send Email button. Scroll down and hit the Send Now button. You will see this email will appear in the Contacted section. You can see the leads that you have contacted in the past, the stages, number of interactions, and also the option to send a follow-up email. The process to send a follow-up email will be same as we have seen previously for sending an email. You can choose to send the follow-up email as a new thread or reply to the previous conversation. As you can see, the stage is now updated from cold email to followed up as we have sent a follow-up email to this lead. You can check the conversation with any lead in detail by clicking on the emails icon. Once this lead responds to your email, it will move to the conversations tab. Let's understand the sequence automation feature. On the sequence page, you will see all your created sequences along with the details. Click on the Create New Sequence button on top right corner of the page to create a new sequence. Enter sequence name and choose preferred time slot of sending emails for this sequence. After the sequence is created successfully, you can see the details of the sequence like number of scheduled, delivered, and replied emails, status of sequence can also be managed from here. Click on the View Steps icon to view and create steps under this sequence. You'll be redirected to the steps page where you will have details of the contacts added in this sequence, emails, the leads response, and also an option to create a new sequence step or event. Let's say I want to create the first step, where leads should get a cold email as soon as they are added in the sequence. So, all the contacts that I will add in this sequence will get a personalized email, on automation. Click on the Add Sequence button and it will ask you to enter the event title in the first field. Let's say Step 1. Then, choose the event type. Webify Sequence can send an email, or notify you to send a custom email, do a phone call, check the LinkedIn post of the lead, send a LinkedIn message, and many more. Let's choose Send Email, so it will send emails to the leads. You can choose any email template that you have saved earlier, or craft a new email as well. I will choose my created template for now. Then, you can choose the time duration to start this event or step. You can set it in minutes or hours after which this step will be initiated. It is calculated from the time, any contact is added to this sequence. I will keep it zero, so the email will be sent instantly when any contact is added. The email body is pre-filled according to the template I chose. You can also edit this if required. Once done, hit the Create Event button to add this event. You can see that a new event is added, and you can also view other details related to the email. Here, you can add another email to the same step for split testing. If I add another email, Webify will split test the emails for you, and you can make further decisions based on the split test report. Now, the final step is to start adding contacts in this sequence. Click on Add Contacts button at the top to do so. You can select multiple contacts at once and click Add to Sequence button at the top. Choose the sequence, let's choose marketing sequence that is just created. And hit the Add to Sequence button. Go back to the Sequence page, and then View Steps page. Make sure to activate the sequence to start sending emails. Click on the Paused button to do so. You can check that these two contacts are added to the sequence successfully, under the Contacts section. Also, you can see the completed steps for each contact, as it varies with the time the contact was added to the sequence. This is how you can find prospects, access their details, and send emails to them, create email lists, email templates, and also automate this entire process with Webify. Apart from this, you also get done for you graphics, email templates, services that you can offer to these leads, get detailed analytics, reports, and much much more with Webify.